After that announcement, CBS's Robert Costa sat down with Vice President Kamala Harris for this Sunday's Face the Nation. He asked Harris about the criticism from within her own party that Democrats have been slow to react to the overturning of Roe versus Wade. I think all of us share um, a deep sense of outrage that the United States Supreme Court took a constitutional right that was recognized, took it from the women of America. We are now looking at a case where the government can interfere in what is one of the most intimate and private decisions that someone can make. What will this administration do to try in the coming months before the election yeah. to codify Roe, to try to, through Congress, put into law some of these priorities. The president acted this morning again with an executive order, but we also need Congress to act because that branch of government is where we actually codify, which means put into law the rights that, again, we took for granted, but clearly have now been taken from the women of America. And that does have to happen, and we should not allow ourselves to, to minimize the significance of that, which is Congress needs to act. Some senators have suggested that Justice Gorsuch, Justice Kavanaugh misled them mm -hmm. during the confirmation hearings on Roe v. Wade. Some Democrats have even called for those justices to be impeached. Do you believe they should be impeached? I mean, listen, I start from um, the point of experience of having served in the Senate. I never believed them. I didn't believe him. That's why I voted against. And you can see more of Robert Costa's interview with Vice President Kamala Harris on Sunday's Face the Nation.